Hello, today we're gonna build a motel in The Sims 4, but the challenge is that each room is a different expansion pack. And why I'm doing this? Well, believe it or not, it is Sims 4's 10 years anniversary tomorrow. Not really sure, but this is the date. 10 years, 10 years. And for that occasion, I really, really wanted to do a build where I use all the packs. But then I remembered that um, I don't own all the packs. <laughs> and if you think I'm gonna buy all the packs just for this video, you're insane. I'm not gonna do that. So, you know, my plans were kind of ruined with that one. But then I realized that I had all the expansion packs that Nora did have. <laughs> so I thought that I was going to do a build where each room is its own expansion pack. And I'm not going to do a spinning wheel with just four rooms and stuff like that. No, each expansion pack is going to get its own room. So it's going to be 16 motel rooms for the 16 expansion packs. And that's what we're going to do today. So um, let's crack on, shall we? Oh, freaking child. All right, so here I am on my little lot. I chose, what is this place called yet? Oh my gosh, I forgot. Oh, Oasis Springs. I have never built in this world before, but I thought that a motel kind of fit in here with all the other stuff. I don't know. I mainly chose this lot because it was big and it had good lighting. That's mainly it. <laughs> so for this build, I came prepared, kind of mostly prepared at least, but I really do want to take some inspiration from the motels in the US from 1970-ish era. Was that even a sentence? I don't even know anymore. <laughs> but yeah, you know, this sort of vibe, the pastel colors, that whole shebang. I mean, look at that. So I think that's my inspiration. Okay. Okay, so I think I'm going to start with one room first, just to see, because I want to make them as small as possible, because otherwise this build is going to be mahusive, okay? So maybe like eight by four, could that be something? And then we need a double bed, that can be there probably, and then we can have a bathroom right there maybe, and then maybe a little chair moment in the corner, yeah. And then we can have some sort of window right there, not that window, but you get my drift. And then I thought we could also have a little kitchen moment. Now, I don't know much about motels, I've never really seen a motel in my entire life, but in this place, they do exist, okay? They just do. And if they're gonna get a stove or not, that depends. <laughs> And in the bathroom, they're all gonna get some sort of bathtub or shower, whatever they have, and then a sink and a toilet. And they're also gonna get a toilet roll, a towel, and another towel, and that's it. They're all gonna get that, no matter what pack, okay? Because otherwise, it's gonna be a very, very sad bathroom. You know, it is. Ooh, and all the rooms are also gonna get a fire smoker. Fire smoker? Smoke alarm. <laughs> Not a fire smoker. That would have been a bad, bad, bad day. And they're also just gonna get a light switch. Just for some realism, I don't know. <laughs> okay, so I think that this is gonna be the layout for all the rooms, all the 16 rooms. I wish that I could do different layouts for all rooms, but one, that's not realistic, and two, there's only 24 hours in a day, you know? <laughs> that's just the truth. But you know what? I could probably do this, this shebang, where everything is the same, just on the opposite side of the room, you know? So I can go every other room is the same. Did that make any sense? Probably not, but here we are. So yeah, now I just have to copy these rooms, like show, and then what am I gonna do in the corner here? Oh, I did not think about that. Well, that wasn't in my plans. My perfect, perfect plans. Okay, what if I put this room here? Oh, yeah. And then I just have to have a Mahuzi room on the end here. I think that's our only option. I do really think so. Oh, okay. All right, I put up all the freaking rooms in this hotel. And I have also put up this, um, what is that called? I put up this uh, thing, you see what it is, with uh, some staircases. And now it's time to paint this uh, thing. And I thought that the one from Love Shrek might be something. Or is it something? Under the roof for this build. I'm gonna look at the reference photo again. Uh, that did not help me. Maybe, uh, think, Nora, think, what can you do? What if I put up a platform with the rounded edge. Mm, could that be something? Then I just need to do that to the whole freaking building. Oh, okay. All right, so I put up the roof. I really do like the platform pieces, but I do not like those short walls because guess what? You cannot get curved half walls. So I don't, I don't know if I like that. What can I do? Can I just do some magic? <laughs> what about this? Nothing to change. Okay. Yeah. Ah, okay. I think I'm finished with the roof. I'm okay with that. I gotta be okay with that. Uh, yeah. Ooh. Right. Now for me, next move, <laughs> I think I'm gonna fence this whole place in. Mm-hmm. <gasps> And then I can have a pool with rounded edges. Yes. Like so. I do think that that could be really fun. Now, one thing that I do really want on the outside here is a parking lot. And how am I going to do that? Laura asked herself very quietly. Well, I can first begin with this. And then I need some parking lines. What could be good for that? Maybe this one from a get to work pack. Then just slice it up. Yeah. And then we can put in some debug cars. What about this one? And then, oh, we can have this one. Oh, that's funky. And uh, my game crashed. Or not. I don't understand what's happening. It's just a black screen but i can do stuff uh most 
of the stuff. Well, that's wonderful. I love that for me. And then for some parking ambiance, I'm gonna put up these ones, which is from the Strangerville pack from D-Bag. I think that's gonna be nice. And it was indeed very nice. <gasps> you know what I also wanna put up? Oh, those uh, parking spot things from uh, what about what high school years. These uh, thingy thingies. If I just put them up right there, that can be so cute, actually. I like that. What else am I gonna do for this place? I mean, we need something around the pool that we do. <laughs> so I think I'm gonna put up some lounge chairs with also some tables and a little debug umbrella. And then over on this side, we can have some outside tables. We can get these chairs. Oh, I like that. That's a vibe and a half if I've ever seen one. And what can we have over here? I want something there. Maybe a little bar? Oh, <gasps> I can go with this bar, the rounded bar with some bar stools. That is the moment. Oh yeah, beautiful. <laughs> now, what we also really need for this place is uh, a little reception area, a little lobby area. So you can check yourself in. <laughs> so maybe I can put up a little box here with also the same roof that's on here. Just a little roof, you know, a little roof like that. That's cute. And then for the inside of that little lobby area, we need, what do we need? We need a desk. So I can put up this one, which is called the front desk. So, I mean, we, we got to have that. And then in this corner, we can have some little chairs. Oh, and then I can put up a magazine stand or a brochure stand. And then in that corner, I would kind of want a place that you could check in your bags, but you would probably have a room for that. That is like locked and stuff. We don't have space for that. So uh, we're just gonna have to get a shelf, you know? We are. And then I can place like a lot of uh, suitcases on there. Just a lot, a lot of them. Oh yes. A very cute little lobby, I must say. Very cute. And what else do we need for this place? We need some plants. That we do need. Wouldn't that be fun for us? There's some plants everywhere I go. Oh yes. It truly is plant city up in here. And there are indeed me plants. Wow. That is truly something. <laughs> Hello, welcome back. My game crashed. It did. My game, my, my game crashed. I literally just finished the whole outside. The landscaping, the exterior, the whole shebang. And while I was saving the game, it crashed while I was saving. So, you know, some of the progress is here, but not all of it. So that means that I have to do that all over again, but I don't want to right now. I'm going to do that again. Okay, I promise. So, um, oh, my suitcases. I had lined them up so nicely, so neat and nice. What a wonderful start to this video. All right, well, let's begin with the rooms. <laughs> Now, my rules for this challenge is that I'm, of course, going to use items from the pack that's representing the room. So, for example, this room is going to be get to work and I have to use whatever I get, you know. But if the pack doesn't have a specific item like a dresser, it doesn't have a dresser, I am allowed to use base game. And that's the only time I'm allowed to use base game, okay? When it literally doesn't exist in the pack. So if I get one wallpaper, this one, and I hate it, I still have to use it because I have it, you know. I can't go base game for that. I can't. So uh, that's, um, that's the rules for this challenge. So yeah, let's start with the rooms. Let's uh, freaking do it. Oh, we're gonna start with room number one. And what pack is that gonna be? Get to work. And yikes. They only have single beds, but don't you worry. You can just place them next to each other. Scooch them in. <laughs> like so. <laughs> Wonderful. They're gonna love that. Yeah, let's have a look at the wallpapers. Oh, yikes. This is going to look like a hospital. It, it really is. What about the flooring? Please say we have some good flooring. Oh. Oh, no. Oh, there's only one swatch in this? Okay. Okay, well, what about the bathroom? I can at least try to make the bathroom all right, you know. Oh, that's scary, but all right. The toilet? Oh, it's the prison toilet. Well, um, that's fun for us. What about the bathtub or the shower? Oh, oh no. <laughs> What an interior nightmare. Can I spice this place up somehow? <laughs> what about a little grate? Industrial metal grate. And instead of a hand towel, we can have this uh, thingy thingy. That's truly really beautiful. I feel like this pack was a really bad pack to start with, you know? Because it's so... It's so sterile. You, I just, is this going to look weird if I put a little sign up? I think it's a for sale sign. But um, we need something at least. We need something here. And uh, the fridge. That's... Uh, is that medicine? Is this like for a pharmacy or something? Oh, that's creepy. Okay. Well, well, um, <laughs> would it be weird if I just have a tray and a rock there? I mean, hopefully not. I actually want a little shelf here too. Is that a soap bar? I hope so. Okay, okay, okay. I think I'm done with the first room. It's so sterile. And um, it, I don't even know what it looks like. A mix between a prison cell and a hospital room. Right, well, let's move on. <laughs> okay, now for the get together room. What can we find in here? The wallpaper is always the scariest. I gotta be honest. Oh, no. What am I gonna do? Ooh, this is just outside wallpaper. Ah! All right. Well, what about the beds? They have no beds. And no, we're not putting in these bushes. No, we are not. <laughs> 
If you have some good chairs. If you have these. Oh, that's horrible. Oh, no. Oh, no. Well, these chairs it is. Okay, what about the bathroom? I'm curious about the bathroom. Did they have bathroom stuff? Okay, they did. They had a nice bathtub. Do they have toilets? No. We're not putting in the pee bush. No, 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 we're not. They have a sink. I mean, that's good. Do they have a little mirror? Oh, they do have that. Great. What about the kitchen? They do not have kitchen stuff. Oh, but they have coffee machines. I can make a little coffee corner. Yeah. Fun, fun day. You know what? I think maybe I can go for this wallpaper. It spices up the place a little bit, you know? And then we can have some sort of brick stony situation here just to <sighs> make some contrast. Make some ambiance. And then for the flooring. Oh, yikes. What can I do for flooring? Maybe this? No, not that. What about that? Uh, I don't know. Yeah. All right. Sure. Okay, what am I going to do for the bed? What bed would fit this place? Ooh, this could work. And now I need a little nice carpet to frame it all in. What do we have? Oh, yikes. That's not good. What about this? Um, maybe. Probably. <laughs> I don't even know anymore. Oh, no, the kitchen. I forgot the kitchen. I need some nice, funky counters. And maybe these counters could work. Uh, maybe. And you know what? It kind of works. It really does. Yeah, that looks kind of nice, doesn't it? Uh, this is the room. I kind of want to clutter it a little bit more. But I have to remember that it is a hotel room, motel room, you know? So it's not supposed to be cluttered. But yeah, it's super cozy in here. I do kind of like it. Uh, moving on to the next room. And what was this supposed to be? City living. Well, all right. What does city living have to offer in the wallpaper section? Oh, oh. oh. I had so many <laughs> emotions right there. Okay, we got this dirty wallpaper. We got some brick and a super fancy wallpaper, right? What about the flooring? Oh, that's a shiny flooring. I do not like that. We also got a dirty carpet. Something very fancy. Stone and oh, oh, oh yikes. But if I just go for the dirty carpet, I don't even know anymore. And then for the bed, ooh. I could go for this bed, but that's not gonna vibe with the flooring. And I have uh, decided on the flooring. I'm going with it. I don't want to deal with the flooring anymore. So maybe this bed and then just hope for the best, really. Oh, that's a very fancy dresser for this room. But uh, we got we got to do it. And then the kitchen. What can I do for the kitchen? Does uh, Silly Living have a counter? Oh, they have counters. That's right. These ugly counters. Mm-hmm. I, um, I have no words. Do we have any bathroom stuff? Yeah, we have a bathtub at least. That's good. Do we have a toilet? Oh, yikes. I hate that toilet. <laughs> but okay. I don't know how I feel about the very modern bathroom with the very shabby everything else. But maybe it could really be something, you know. Maybe it really could. Um, I don't know. But it could. Okay, let me put some nicky knacks in hand there. Okay, put up this one as well. Could have a fun time. You know what? I have to say, this room didn't turn out half bad, you know? It's kind of cute. Kind of funky. I like that carpet. Yeah. Approved by Nora. Okay, now this room. What was that room supposed to be? Cats and dogs. Oh, I like that pack. I do really like this bed. I think that would be cute for us. All the bedside tables are so huge. Humongous, you might say. And then we can have these chairs in pink. Can have a little pink moment in here? That never hurt anybody. A dresser. Oh, this is my favorite dresser, actually. Actually. And then, oh, we could get this one. That is so cute. I love that. Oh, I totally forgot about the kitchen and the bathroom. All right. Do they have a toilet? Yes, they do. Yeah, they have sinks. Do they have a bathtub? Yes, they do. Wow. What a lovely, lovely day. Okay, so for the kitchen, they, of course, have no kitchen stuff. Why would they? But I could go for a cutesy little moment. Maybe something like that. Mm -hmm. And I'm going to be super nice today and give them a stove. You know, maybe they would like a stove. <laughs> maybe they would. Sure. This room works for me. And by the way, the dog kind of looks like a little seal. Interesting. Interesting. Oh, there's the room. Looking all nice and dandy. Let's move on to this humongous room. Oh, yikes. I am not really sure what to do with this room. What pack is this going to be? Seasons. Oh, no. <gasps> no. They only have this wallpaper. And it's so ugly. I mean, it's okay for, like, outside wallpaper, you know? But for inside? Oh, no. How am I going to do this layout? That's a great question. Wait, hold a minute. I need to draw this up. Okay, I've done a quick little layout. <laughs> or a panic move layout, I would rather say. But here's the primary bedroom, and then a kid's bedroom, a bathroom, kitchen, dining, living room situation. So it's going great. And uh, as you can see, Seasons has no flooring. So I went with base game. Because that's allowed. Right. What are we going to begin with first? Maybe the primary bedroom. I'm going to see what's going on there. Oh, we can use this bed. Okay, that's nice. That's nice. On the other side, we could have a little dresser. Then we can put up a mirror on there. Yes, that is very much up there. <laughs> and then this was going to be kid's bedroom. We can put up this bed. I mean, that's okay. Get it a nice color. I said nice. This one might be. Ah, uh, I don't know. Then a little dresser. We also need a nightstand. Oh, yikes. And then the living room. What am I going to do here? I honestly don't know. What about this couch? Do they have 
any nice colors. Oh, maybe I can go for this. Sure. Any nice carpet? Oh, no. This is an ugly carpet. What about this one? Oh, yikes. It just has to work. That is ugly, but oh, what else am I supposed to do? Do we have a dining table? Oh, that's humongous. We're not gonna fit that in there. No, no, no. We're just gonna have a kitchen and they're just gonna have to live with it. All right, they really are. We can go for this sort of vibe, you know? A little industrial, industrial vibes. What about the bathroom, actually? I'm curious about the bathroom. Oh, that's a nice tub. All right, do they have a sink? <gasps> they have a sink. Oh, they even have a toilet. Wowee, what a blessed day. And then back here, we need something there. Do we have something to put there? Oh, we do. I mean, that could work. I mean, is it creepy to have that little man there? I mean, it's a little creepy. Gotta be honest. But maybe the pumpkins will help. Did that help? Not, not really. Do we have any paintings? Any painting paintings? Oh, yikes. Please say that there's a good swatch. Um, not really. Oh, they have a bookcase, though. Can I put that somewhere? Maybe I can put that here. That's looking ridiculous. <laughs> but I think I've made something uh, work. I think I kind of did. I mean, I like the bathroom. And the kitchen is looking all right. Oh, I mean, we're not going to discuss this living room. It doesn't exist to me. I am mad. Let's <laughs> go to the next room. And what is that going to be? Get famous. Okay. Oh, no. Am I really going to go for this vibe? I No, I can't do that to myself. I'm sorry. I'm going to go for this vibe. I'm sorry, but it's just going to be like that. I don't have the mental capacity to go the other way. Mm -mm -mm. Oh, that's a nice dresser. I kind of like that. Do we have some funky chairs? Oh, we have some funky chairs. I think this is going to be a cute little room. I do believe. I mean, again, my hopes aren't that high. Okay. You know what I can do for a compromise? We can make this bathroom very ugly. Oh, yikes. It's going to be a very nice bathroom, this one. I can already feel it. Oh, I could have a funky orange kitchen. Oh, okay. I mean, would that be fun? It really could be a vibe, you know? And then I can get them a little shell moment. <laughs> I really don't know. <laughs> Maybe. This room is going places that I don't, I don't know where. Oh, the curtains. I did not think about the curtains. We have this curtain. Oh, no. I mean, sure, whatever. And then we have to have this curtain in the bathroom. <laughs> that is not gonna be good. Oh, no. <laughs> you know what? This room didn't turn out half bad. I do actually like it, you know? It's funky. It's nice. It's neat. I mean, the bathroom. I, that's a whole nother deal. <laughs> the bathroom. But we're gonna move on to the next room now, which is going to be island living. Oh, I like island living. I love it. And we got a funky bed. That's neat and nice. Do we have a cool dresser? Oh, we do. <laughs> this pack has some good stuff, actually. It has some vibes. What about the bathroom? Do we have bathroom stuff? Okay, they do not have toilet. And no, I'm not gonna put up this. No. Ooh, they actually have a funky shower. I'm gonna put that up. That's cool. And then what about this wallpaper? Oh, that's a scary room. <laughs> Maybe I can soften it up with uh, this sort of wallpaper. Bada bing, bada boom. Oh, wait. Island living has kitchen stuff, don't they? Oh, yes, they do. And maybe I can have a little stove as well, because I'm feeling nice today. And do they have cabinets? No, they do not. But they have a funky, funky shelf. Oh, Jai's is the carpets. I mean, like, yeah. Ooh, uh. What about decorations? Do they have any nice pictures? Ooh, they have this uh, fun guy. <laughs> oh, you know what I could do? I could put up a little wall right there and some columns, like so, and just make a little moment. What a move by Nora. All right, I'm going to put up some little Nicky Nacks that we wear. There's some cute ones. There's a lamp and stuff. Only me. Cool beans. Cool beans. What is that? I don't know. All right. So here is the room. I do indeed like it so much. It's so cute. And the bathroom didn't turn out half bad, you know? And even the kitchen. I put up a little window there. Put a little window moment. Very nice indeed. Okay, let's move on to... Oh, the last room on this floor. On the first floor. We have a whole nother floor left. Oh, okay. Well, we're gonna move on to this room. And that room is gonna be Discover University. All right. How is the wallpaper situation? That's right. Look at this wallpaper. Oh, no. I mean, I think... I can go with this sort of vibe. No. What about this vibe? Sure. Another flooring. Oh, yikes. Oh my gosh. That means that we have to have carpet in the bathroom too. Well, that's fun for us. What about the bed? Oh, I do not like that bed. What if I take these beds and just push them together? <laughs> and then the chairs. Do we have some cool chairs? Oh, we have these ones. I don't know how I feel about that. Oh, they have them in pink. That's kind of a vibe. And then for the kitchen. That's cute. We can, um, what can we go for? Maybe a little beige kitchen. And then we can have a little bar moment. Yeah. With some funky chairs. What a fun kitchen. I'm I say. Oh, wait, the bathroom. Do you have any toilets? We have this one, but that's obviously not gonna fit. So it's a no for me. Okay, what can I do to this bathroom to make it more bathroomy? Can I put up a carpet and uh, do some funky stuff? What if I size it down and just put it up <laughs> this carpet? 
to make it look like tiles? That is ridiculous, Nora. How do I come up with these ridiculous ideas that obviously does not work? But I'm gonna do it anyways, because why not? <laughs> I mean, okay, I gotta be honest, the bathroom isn't looking that bad, you know? It really isn't. And what a room, what a room. I actually do like it for what it is, okay? For what it is. It looks like a dorm room, and it probably is a dorm room. Oh, all right. Let's move on to the second floor. Wow. Okay, so for this room, what is this room going to be? Oh, eco lifestyle. Okay, okay, okay. Maybe we can go for this sort of paneling. Then, what about this? Boom. Interesting choice by Nora. Not sure if I like that or not. <laughs> what about the bathroom? Oh, that's a nice bathtub. Oh, no. I stay incorrect. It's not a nice bathtub. What about the toilet? Oh, yeah, that's right. It's just a little bit creepy when toilets doesn't have um, a toilet lid. You know, that's what I'm thinking about. Oh, we have a mirror as well. Well, isn't that wonderful for us? Yikes. <laughs> well, we need a bed at least. Oh, okay. I like that bed. Do we have some chairs? Yeah, we can have these uncomfortable chairs. I would hate to sit in those. I would. Bada bing, bada boom. Hope you enjoy that. Another kitchen. They have no kitchen stuff, of course. None of the packs have freaking kitchen stuff. For I don't know. So we have to go with base game. And maybe we can go for this sort of vibe again. That's a fun vibe to have in this day and age. Diana. <laughs> Wait, oh, in the bathroom, I can also put up these funky little things. Or would that be funky? I don't even know. Most days, I don't really know anything. Where am I going to put up this one? Here. Uh. And I'm also just going to put up this one just right above the bed. Boop. All right. So that was the room. <laughs> And I do actually really love it. Like, look, it's so cozy in here. I love it. Now we're moving on to this room. And what pack is that going to be? Oh, snowy escapes. And I think we're going to start off with this wallpaper. And then in the bathroom, we go for this one. And maybe one of the sides can be this wallpaper. That's kind of cute, isn't it? I don't want it for the whole bathroom, but just as a little accent wall is popping on in there. Yeah, no? Mm-hmm. And then the flooring. Oh, okay. We have these mats and we have sand. I mean, this isn't looking great for us, is it? <laughs> well, okay, I could go for the mats. Well, I have to go for the mats. I have no other option, really. What am I talking about? Okay, I'm procrastinating. I need to put in these mats and I need to do it in the pattern that suits this room. And I have tried to Google a 5x5 five five room like this one and I can't find any solid answers. So I think I'm going to procrastinate a little bit more and I'm going to do the kitchen. <laughs> Ooh, they have some great stuff in here. Great vibes. Wait, am I going to put in sand in the bathroom by the freaking way? Maybe I am. Oh no, we're not going to talk about this bathroom. We are really not. Um, <laughs> and we have a nice shower as well. Wow, we truly could have it all today. Except for the flooring. We could not have that. All right, now I'm going to put up the flooring. I am. I, oh, okay. And here we have the flooring. Yes. I really just had to make something up. But I did manage to do the tea room pattern in this corner. So at least that is something to be happy about. <laughs> but all right, I am done with this room for now. Wow, I do kind of like it. It's kind of cute. It has the vibes. The bathroom. I mean, that's a whole nother story, okay? We're not talking about the bathroom. All right, moving on to this room. What is that room going to be? Oh, cottage living. I love me some cottage living. What color scheme are we going to go for in here? I mean, we can go for green, maybe. I'm feeling green today. I do love cottage living. They're one of my favorite packs of all time. Like, seriously, I do think that cottage living is my favorite pack. I cannot one up. Like, it is the top one pack in my life. In my life. We would have thunk it. I mean, probably most people, if I'm being honest. <laughs> probably. I am not even surprised about this pack. Like, I know this pack, like the back of my hand. Oh, that was a pattern and a half. Maybe not the back of my hand because I didn't know that that pattern existed. Uh, you know what? I don't like that table there. Maybe I can use something else. What if I just use this little barrel instead? <laughs> Is that gonna be weird? I mean, I like it. Oh, and I need a little plant in the corner. Boop. And that was the little cottage living room. And I love it so much. So cozy. The vibes are immaculate. You know, even got a little gnome. And now for this room and this pack is gonna be high school years. Oh, one of my favorite every pack. So, oh, the wallpaper. I did not think about the wallpaper. They mostly have um, stony, stony, stony walls. <laughs> oh, that's a nice bathroom wall. You know what? I'm gonna go for this one for the bathroom. That's nice. I want that in real life. And some nice uh, flooring to go along with that. Boom. Oh no, that means I have to use this for the whole room as well. Oh, yikes. Okay. Well, let's not think about that. Let's uh, think about the bathroom. Oh, they have this toilet. Well, we're not gonna use that. No, no, no. What about the sinks? Okay, they have a nice sink. Yeah, they do. Do they have any bathtubs? No, nope. I was nope. Okay. Well, gotta find that myself, I guess. Gotta
have to do everything myself these days. Get the bed. What bed do we want? <gasps> Maybe I can go for this vibe in pink. Oh, that could be cool. And then some matching chairs and a matching dresser. I mean, that's very cute. I like that. Okay, now for the kitchen. Do we have any kitchen stuff? Nope, we do not. Into beige game we go. Oh, I haven't seen that color before. Is this a new swatch? Photo code new swatch? I haven't seen that one before. All right. And then we can have the matching microwave and some nice cabinets as well. I mean, no, we are why. Right, now for decorations. What can I do for that? Oh, some funky lights. Oh, the plants are not looking good. Oh, yikes. Well, let's not care about that. And we can instead put up this nice carpet. Well, is it a good idea to have two alarm clocks in a hotel room? Probably not. Oh, you can fight about that amongst yourself. Oh, can I put this canopy thingy over the bed? Oh, that would be so cool. I mean, that is really something. Oh, wow. I like that. Alrighty, so this is the high school years room. And oh my gosh, I do really like this. This is so cute. Look at this. Everything is matching oh wow oh, wow look at the bathroom truly really amazing let's move on to this room and uh, oh this is one of the big rooms and what pack is that gonna be growing together oh no they only have bathroom tiles as flooring and i have to use that yikes very much yikes what am i going to do i think i'm gonna start with the layout first i mean that seems reasonable for me okay so it's a little while later <laughs> I have tried with this layout so many times now, and I think I finally got some sort of layout. So we have the primary bedroom here, and then bathroom, kitchen, dining, living room, then a hallway, and there's a kid's bedroom. And here is the infant's room, the infantry. So in the primary bedroom, we can have a bed. Wow. And some little nightstands to go along with that. And then we can put up a nice chair and this nice uh, closet. And then for the bathroom, I mean, we have a lot of nice bathroom stuff. We have this beautiful Jabba tub combo and a sink do we have a toilet no but you know beautiful bathroom and then for the infant's room we need of course a bed crib you might call it oh my gosh this room looks so sad with that flooring but we're just gonna have to ignore it people we're just gonna have to ignore it oh yikes maybe a carpet will save it did it save it i don't know honestly this hotel room is gonna be so ugly <laughs> oh in the kids bedroom we can have a bunk bed i mean that was really a genius idea by nora it was oh we can have this little tree decal decal i mean not decal <laughs> and we can have a little toy chest. I know that this isn't a personal home. It's a hotel motel. At the motel hotel. Okay, but we can be nice today. What am I gonna do for this hallway? It's so um, bare and empty. Maybe another carpet. We only have one carpet to use for this whole gosh darn place. And I'm not gonna use these ones. Just look at them. What is that? What am I supposed to do with this? What am I supposed to do? Right, then for the kitchen. Oh, they have a fridge. That's right. Do they have a stove? Yes, yeah, a nice beautiful stove. Whoa. And look at the nice decorations I put on the wall, by the way. I found it and I panicked and I ran with it. Okay. Do they have counters? No, they do not. What counters am I gonna go for? Maybe these ones? That'd be a vibe. Could it? You know what? I think this could work for a little kitchen. Yeah, what about the dining table? Do we have some good dining tables? Please. <gasps> we do. Oh, thank God. Beautiful. Okay, what about the <laughs> living room? Oh, no. Do we have some good couches? Oh, we have this one. Can I squeeze that in? I think I can. Oh, board games. Board games. That we need. What? Does that pink chair in the corner there work? Or is that... Um, no, I like the pink one. I'm on about. All right, so that was the growing together apartment. No, not apartment. Hotel, motel, room. <laughs> I've, I think this could have been so much better if I had some real flooring and not tile. Because right now it's looking um, kind of sad. But anyways, let's move on to this room. What room is that going to be? Oh, horse ranch. So what are we going to start with? Maybe the bed. This bed in light blue. Oh, that's nice. And then some night tables. That's not what they're called, Nora. And then a dresser. Ooh, funky. Welcome to funky town, people. Oh, the wallpaper. Why didn't I put in wallpaper? And then the flooring. It could be something like that. Or is that weird? How will that look with the carpet? Sure. <laughs> oh, that's right. They have cabinets. Not cabinets. Counters. We actually have bathroom stuff. Well, we have no toilets. Do you have a sink? Oh, we have a sink. What about a bathtub? Oh, that we have. You know what confuses me a lot with packs? Is that they often come with a sink and a shower or bathtub, but never a toilet. Why? And the same thing with kitchens. Like, sometimes they come with counters, but no other kitchen stuff. Or they come with a fridge and a stove, but no counters. And it's just like, but why? Like, I want a horse ranch fridge. I want one. And I've paid $49 for this pack. And I want a horse ranch fridge. Where did that accent come from? I don't even know. But any hoozles, it is my little horsey. Boop. And that was the room. I love this room. Look, this is so cute. I want to live here. And look at the bathroom. I mean, come on, the bathroom. That is magnificent. All right, let's move on into this room. And what pack is that going to be? Oh, for rent. Okay. Why is there a window there? That's what I want to know. <laughs> what? All right, for rent. I haven't really 
really play that much with for rent i gotta be honest because um the renting system doesn't really work and that's the whole pack really so what are you supposed to do other than cry obviously crying is always an option it really is okay the bed do we have a good bed that's cute and some funky night time night time tables i come up with new words every time i say night stands i really do i not only deleted one room i deleted two galore all right do they have <gasps> they have counters you know what i also do i always say cabinets instead of counters probably not heard me say that in the videos because i cut it out but just know that every time i encounter a counter i say cabinet i can't help myself it just happens and then the bathroom do we have something nice for the bathroom oh we have a sink we have toilets what, what do i want to go for maybe this one i don't know <laughs> i've never used a toilet before but today is the day people okay what type of flooring do i want here do i want that vibe or this vibe or that vibe I'm not really sure. These are the times that I would wish that I was streaming or something because I truly don't know what I'm gonna do. Maybe I'm gonna choose that one. Maybe I am. Do we have some good curtains though? Oh yes, we do. That's right. This pack, it doesn't disappoint people. Eh, no. Okay. It disappointed a little bit with those curtains. <laughs> All right. So here is the room. Boom, 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 boom. It's so cozy in here. I really freaking like this room. The bathroom too. Cute and fresh and fun. I struggled a little bit with the curtain, but you know what? Whatever. Oh, <gasps> we're gonna move on to the last room. Oh wow. What is the last? room oh love track duh <laughs> all right for this room what am i gonna do for this room i think i'm gonna put up the heart bed because it's iconic and she is the moment and the dresser oh that's right i'm not really sure if that is a dresser or if it's just like a costume trunk you know because i haven't had time to play with the pack yet like gameplay wise i haven't had time to play the pack yet so i'm not really sure maybe i'm gonna put up a base game dresser just in case you know oh maybe i should also put up some flooring and wallpaper too that's a good idea and then we can have a little accent wall. Yeah, sure. Do we have a shower? Yes, we do. And then we need a toilet and a sink. And they have no toilets, no sinks. That's right. Well, I'm gonna put up these then. Problem solved. Okay, now the kitchen. What am I gonna do here? I can go for these ones. They seem to fit in here, do you believe? Oh, that lines up perfect with the window. Wow. Never in my entire life has that happened to me. Who would have thunk it that that could happen to Anora? Oh no, the curtains. I forgot about the curtains. Maybe something like that could work, probably. Maybe it has to work. I don't want to deal with this anymore. Trying to find 16 different curtains for all these rooms has been a nightmare there's no other way about it it has been a nightmare okay not fun not fun to do <laughs> all right you tidies that was the love struck room <laughs> and it's actually really cute there's the bathroom as well you could kill wow 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 and that was indeed all the rooms in this motel hotel but i don't know 16 rooms 16 expansion packs oh my wow truly wow do i have to say anything profound right now i don't know i don't want to anyways well i'm gonna fix up the things that uh, went missing <laughs> and then we shall do a little house tour oh yes we are wow and now it is indeed time for a little house tour so i hope you enjoyed that because i'm gonna enjoy it i am and for this house tour i'm gonna show you pictures of the rooms while i'm talking because that seems like a fun idea <laughs> no the reason for that is that uh, my sims camera right now is so broken it, i don't know what happened to it it's just whenever i move it's glitching out so i'm just gonna show you pictures instead because i don't want to deal with that right now no 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 so yeah but this was uh, a really really fun build actually i had a lot of fun and to my surprise all the rooms turned out so different from each other which i just i didn't expect at all they look so different from each other that's amazing for me at least what a journey and what i also found out from this challenge is that you can really see the progression of the expansion packs from newest to oldest because the get together pack what was that one wallpaper come on <laughs> what is that what so that was something at least for me and i'm kind of debating on how i'm gonna put this build on the gallery because i can either put this build on the gallery as a residential rental is that was called the residential rental or i could just put it on the gallery as a normal residential place i'm kind of debating that because not all of you have the for rent pack and you kind of need that pack to get a residential lot in your world but also the residential stuff it's kind of buggy i don't really know how to do it because each time i do it something goes wrong so maybe i'm just gonna put it out as a residential lot and then if you want to make it into a little apartment space then you can do that yourself i don't know maybe i can do that or maybe not also what i always want to talk about this is a therapy session for nora so listen closely but not too close 
<laughs> As you know, I began university. My college university journey again last week. Was it last week? No, it was last last week. And um, it's been going great. I found out that I'm studying digital marketing, which I don't know why I chose that, but apparently I chose that, which is fun for me. Don't know what I'm going to do with that, but um, something probably. And believe it or not, this is the second week of studies. Like first week was just like introductions and stuff like that. So this is like the first real week of um, college university. And believe it or not, but our first assignment is a group project, a graded group project and it's due next week. Why? I mean, starting higher education is hard enough. Okay, then you're putting group projects on top of that in the first week and it's graded with people I don't know. You know what, in that moment that I found out that we were gonna have group projects, I almost dropped out. I'm not even joking. I almost dropped out. So yeah, and you may also know that um, the reason for Nora beginning college university, it was to get a break from her job. That was mainly the only reason I did it. But what I found out is that I can't quote unquote quit my job or take a break from my job straight away. Even though I'd planned this uh, weeks in advance. No, I did not. I planned this days in advance. <laughs> but apparently you can't just quit your job right on the spot. So I still have some projects left at work that I have to do while also studying full time. Which is um, it has been an experience. I wonder how long I can keep this up without getting burnt out. I do wonder because right now I have a full time job and I'm also studying full time. And I'm also doing this, but this is fun. This is okay. But the other two, I mean, they can go and ah. And I guess I haven't really told what my job is? Have I? I probably not. Oh, well, what is my job title? It has a weird name, my job title. Okay, so in Norwegian it's called Junior Creator, which in English is Junior Creator. But I don't like that word because that sounds like I'm like Junior God. You know how you say like the creator when you reference it to God? So it sounds like I'm Junior God, which I can promise you I'm not. You can never be 100% sure. But basically, what do I do at work? I just do stuff at work, basically. I, <laughs> I don't even know what I do at work. I do a lot of stuff. It's basically everything that has to do with corporate design I have to do which uh, sounds very fun and exciting but um it's not because it would have been fun if you were in like a creative environment but I'm doing design stuff in a corporate world where no fun is allowed no creativity is allowed and uh yeah so that's what I do at work and no I don't design furniture and stuff like that it's just mostly graphic stuff and I also do some other stuff which makes me a creator and not a graphic designer because apparently those are two different things whatever it's a very um not fun job to say the least. So that was a sad ending to my story. <laughs> so if you're ever wondering, hmm, Nora has kind of low energy in this video. She seems dead behind her eyes. <laughs> well, that's just because for the next few weeks, I have to work from 9 in the morning to 10 p.m. at night every day, even on weekends, seven days a week. And I've already done that for two weeks now. And uh, it's amazing. <laughs> well, at least I got this. <laughs> at least I got this. Anyways, is the house tour done now? So I feel like I had a therapy session. Also, I just really want to shout out this person Person, this little person here who made some incredible cute drawings of me. Look at them. They're so cute. So uh, thank you so much. That was really nice of you. I like them. Thank you for that. Bright my day. And um, <laughs> that was the end of the house tour. And that was the end of this video. And this is the outro. <laughs> I really hope you enjoyed this video. I really enjoyed this video. It was very therapeutic for me, I must say. And uh, if you for some reason want to download this build, it is up on my gallery as a residential or a rental. Who knows? And my gallery ID is just Nora Gaming. Mm -hmm. And uh, don't forget to like, subscribe because it really it does help me out so um thank you but only if you want to only if you want to and i will see you guys next time goodbye